What's up guys, welcome to Supercars of London in Germany at the Nürburgring. Today's video is going to be a tour of the Nürburgring for anyone that hasn't been here before. I wanted to create this video showing you guys what this place is all about. This is essentially motorsport city with one of the most world famous racetracks right here going around spreading miles and miles and miles all the way through the forest over there. Not only that, but I'm going to be taking you on a tour of the Rentec headquarters, the European headquarters where my car got its first modification. Firstly, we are going to try and navigate our way back down past the main straight. I've already seen something white with red wheels so we need to go and catch up. And this place is literally, we've got so many cool cars all around it. There's the famous Nürburgring building right there. Sounds good right now. Where do we go? Down here? Maybe not. <laughs> Welcome to an idiot's tour of the Nürburgring. <laughs> Here we go. We've got a race on our hands. There's an MG GTS Edition 1 there. Let's get this scud. We are going them completely the wrong way. Black scud, no stripe. Oh, white has just pulled out. I think it's a Porsche GT4, you know. Just for a change. Yeah. <laughs> look, wait, wait, get that one and then get this one, look, behind. There. Did you get it? Yep. There is GT4s everywhere. Oh, that is a cool GTR. There he goes. <laughs> Bye! So we have come to outpost number one, which we actually haven't checked out before. So this is the first time that we've doing it. We're parking the Rentec A45 there and check out the view that we get right here. <laughs> So here we go, my first ever experience of the Nürburgring in real life. Lucas is gonna be driving, he's gonna be showing me the ropes. We've got a GoPro up here, fingers crossed. We can get some cool shots. goes up and down. Yep. <laughs> That's all about it. <laughs> but uh, basically <clears throat> when we pass the so-called um, Flugplatz in a few moments it will be uh, going only downhill and then you will see that the Nord Schleife is really like a very special track. We have uh, around 300 meters of height difference between the highest and the lowest point of the track. That sounds incredible. Yeah, it's a Rentec special exhaust on this one. Ah. <laughs> also turbo upgrades. Turbo I mean, upgrades? I mean, you can feel how it still pushes going yeah. uphill. <laughs> like there's no tomorrow. 
How much power has this car got? This is a 700 horsepower stage. 700 horsepower? Yes. <laughs> you didn't tell me that when you got when I got in the car. <laughs> <laughs> well, um... <laughs> That was insane. As you can already tell from the car behind, a GLE 63 AMG Coupe, that I am here at the Rentec headquarters. Being interrupted by a Porsche. I'm here at the Rentec European headquarters and Sasha here is joining me for a bit of a tour around your headquarters, your yeah, European, European headquarters. headquarters yeah. uh, because it is a seriously special building if I pan this way and there are some pretty insane cars inside, so I suppose, let's go inside, check out that CLS, which is done by Rentec, as you can tell by the number plate, my Rentec 63. Let's go and check this out through the window and then head through the front door. Hey, he's there. He's just walked in through the door. <laughs> I'm joined by Lucas, who is the owner here at Rentec Germany, and you're showing me an SLS GT3 car, but it's not just any SLS GT3 car. Yeah, yeah. This is a very special one. Um, this car belongs to a customer from Black Falcon racing team. But uh, very special about this car is and I think it's the only one that is in, in the private hand because these uh, cars uh, have only been, let me think about, there have been only five cars built total. Um, and you can see that this is a very special plate on the engine which is signed by two people. So there is uh, one guy who built the engine and uh, he built it together with Bernd Schneider, the famous racing driver, who wow. won with Black Falcon the 24-hour race here twice already. So, um, so, so this is a very special car with a passenger seat uh, and it was used by MG uh, for taxi drives on, on race tracks. But this is, I think, the only car in, in, uh, that was sold to a, to a private so person. So it's a privately owned car yes. that... Yeah has been used as a, as a sort of a VIP demonstrator for the Nürburgring. Exactly. Wow. Yeah. Okay, so we're done with the racing cars. Now let's move over to the road cars. This is the Rentec CLS shooting brake, which is an absolute beast. The carbon fiber rear diffuser, which I will get onto. And just as an exterior package, this car is totally incredible. If I saw this in my rear view mirror, then I would probably, uh, well, wet myself a little bit because I can imagine underneath this hood, not only does it look aggressive from the outside, I'm pretty sure this car is going to be totally incredible to drive. Um, and the coolest thing about the collaboration between Rentec and Black Falcon is Black Falcon is the racing team, Rentec is the street road car. Basically, they're sharing so many experiences from the track and on the road to share their experiences and their knowledge to basically create the best of both worlds for racing drivers and for road drivers. So Lucas, do you want to tell me about this car? Yeah, this is uh, basically my CLS. Um, it's yours? Drive, yeah, yeah. I, I, <laughs> I didn't realise that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't drive that often because it's also quite a special car. It's the only one built without a sunroof. Okay. Uh, spe on special order and this is also a special paint, uh, which is uh, SLS uh, Designio um, Imola Grey, which was never um, used on a CLS. So that's the only car without a sunroof and uh, in this paint. And apart from that, it's, uh, yeah, obviously Rentec tuned with, uh, you know, um, a small turbo upgrade, ECU uh, remap, downpipes, and Rentec wheels on it and all the aero stuff. So it's V8 by turbo, powered by Rentec. How much brake horsepower has this car got? This is 800, and <laughs> we also have stages over 800. So, wow. Yeah. Wow. Here we go. Let's move forward into the workshop. This is a nice car. <laughs> <laughs> so this is any petrol heads heaven. Black Falcon and Rentec together, AMG and Porsche. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is the C63 Black Series that's red. Fast, really fast. So it's 6.2 naturally aspirated V8 with how much brake horsepower? Um, this one is at 560 at this moment. This one's 560. Yeah. Wow. So you can still add like 30 horsepower more. Yeah. Um, but the problem in Germany is, you know, 
it needs to be street legal yeah. for registration stuff. So uh, that's at the edge or um, where it yeah. can be legally. Legally, uh, otherwise it will be too loud. Yeah. So much Alcantara, so much Alcantara, which is not factory. No, this is also uh, a customized car completely. Wow. And it's got Rentec uh, upgraded brakes? Yes, there, there are special brakes because I think this is, I, I don't know if it's the only one, but um, this is a mixture of an AMG uh, ceramic brake disc uh, system with Rentec performance brake pads, uh, braided steel lines, and uh, yeah and all the power upgrades, it's really like an animal. Yeah, yeah, and so... Especially it, the way it sounds. <laughs> yeah, it sounds amazing. So we're gonna, we're gonna go for a bit of a drive. There are fantastic roads around Germany. I thought people come to the Nürburgring to drive the ring, but I think some people come to drive the incredible roads yeah, yeah. around, because we've been exploring today and they've been absolutely phenomenal. So we're gonna go and try and find some really cool, quiet roads so that you guys can hear this car, but also see it on the road and in action as well, so. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to it. I've never ridden passenger in a in a C63 Black Series. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! 